Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hello, gorgeous friend, it's Robin. Welcome to Morning Magic. Welcome to our time to be together, to shine a light, to remember the light, to practice the light, even on the shitty days. We are here, <laughs> we are practicing, and guess what? I love you. You're amazing. Thank you for being here. Did I say it's me, Robin? It's me, Robin. So good morning, good morning, good morning. This is morning magic. Whatever came before, however the day has been so far, this is our moment to choose again. Choose anew. Choose what we want. Practice, practice, practice. So good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I hope that the vibes in your heart are gorgeous, beautiful, wonderful, sparkling. And if they're not, you gotta know, you are so perfect. Ah, you are so loved. You are so amazing. It's not about how you're acting. It's about who you are in your heart, you know, truly. So all of you is welcome here exactly as you is. and. You are so loved. So good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hello, friends. Hello. Let me say hi to you, beautiful souls. Hi, Lexi. First one here today. Hi, Caitlin. Miss Melanie. Boo, boo. Melanie, Babu in the house. Amy. Hello. Alicia. Hello. Miss Amanda. Gardening Bounty. Hello. Here we are. Good morning, Melanie. Yes. Hello. Hello. Hi, Carrie. Hello, Anna. How are you today? I hope that the weather in your heart is excellent. Hello, Bex. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Friends, I need to say it right at the top. You are our family. This is our family, our morning magic family. Framily. We are together. We are love. We are practicing. Thank you for being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So there's a lot of noise going on here in the um, neighborhood right now. Um, construction next door, mowing people, and right now the man is here delivering my little swimming pool. It's just a trough for cows and horses and sheeps to drink fresh water from. but. I see the truck outside and number one is doing things so I hope you know sometimes maybe you just need to put another flower in your hair and get on with it right <laughs> so I love you how are you how's your day going how have you been how was the night let me know did you hug yourself today mm, mm, mm. did you do it did you show up for you today I want to know Sometimes, you know, you just need a do-over morning, too. That was me that today. I woke up and I was like, yesterday I was telling you this, I woke up, same thing again today. I was like, oh, shit, another day. I don't know where it comes from, but, you know, a little self-love, a little acceptance, a little music, a little yoga, a little coffee. Where is my coffee? We need to cheers. And all is right with the world again, you know? It's just practicing, it's practicing, it's practicing. So yes, in just one moment, Miss Miss Shelley, beautiful soul. Hello, Stuart. Hello, Carol. Let us cheers. Cheers to you, cheers to this day, cheers to the vibes in a wonderful way. All is well. And no matter how you're feeling, it's still the truth. You are sparkling beauty and sunshine. Whoop, whoop, de whoop. That was my poem, my love poem for you. <laughs> I have coffee, iced coffee. Cheers. So good. I'm wearing another Tanya Jenny original. Her t-shirts are so fun. Um, this is my favorite design, the good vibes one. I don't like when they say good vibes only, because come on, please, let's be real. It's me, you know? I don't know if you feel like that about yourself, but like, please, 
they're not always good vibes and that's fine I love myself and my choice is good vibes but you know it's okay if I'm not in a good space I still love myself what about you <laughs> so let's know what did you choose for your word of the day today I want to know I want to know if you hugged yourself um, what are we focusing on tell me tell me true good morning miss Lizzie girl hello 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 <laughs> you love my mug and the tea Jeff said to me today thank you it's got a little look the prince is in here um, Jeff said to me today oh my god this is a different day for you because you never use this mug I was like yeah this is Jeff's mug but I'm using it green heart chakra frogs I have a thing for frogs I'm not sure why or how because if I see them in real life I scream like a little girl so <laughs> here we go back to you what is your word of the day Carrie says thanks Amanda um, Carrie says, yep, me too. Do over morning and I put my feet out the door and took a walk and hummed along to the birdies. That's so beautiful. I danced, why am I sweating? I'll tell you why. I danced to Michael Franti. I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive. This is what it sounds like. I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive. This is what it sounds like. And before that, Elton John, yeah. Someone saved my life tonight, sugar bear. You almost had your hooks on me, didn't you, dear? I got it all worked out. So, <laughs> mm, Elizabeth says, me is my word of the day. That's beautiful, honey. Me and you, later, we're going to the beach together. Pack your mask. I have a I have a I have a Hawaiian mask I'm gonna wear. You're gonna love it. Forgiveness, Shelly, that's beautiful. That is a beautiful word. Forgiveness. Alicia, my word of the day is invigorated. Ooh, that's beautiful. I love it. Lexi's word is consistency. Hmm, that's really nice. And I hope that you are consistently loving yourself and your own sweetheart. There is a man trimming the bushes. I just closed the window a little. Um, <laughs> it's loud. Amy says, I hugged myself and it felt so great. My word of the day is self-love. There you go. You know... There's all this evidence about contact, skin to skin contact and, you know, like mother baby hugs and stuff. Well, you are the mother and the baby. You are the skin to the skin. If you choose to hug yourself in that way, you know, you, you are making your own energy vibes, right? That's the practice. And choosing to do that, choosing to rise beyond your Oh, this is stupid. I'm not doing it. This is dumb. <laughs> do you ever talk like, this is so dumb and not going to do it? <laughs> Choosing to go beyond that is everything. So help your nervous system, you know, use your conscious awareness to train your nervous system like, I want to feel better. That's all. Period. <laughs> so uh, Beck says, word of the day Put it on the cosmic dump truck. There you go. Practicing detachment. Amen. Waiting for a dump truck. Anytime now. There's a lot going on next door. Cute. Yeah, Michael Franti. That's right. There is a Morning Magic playlist on Spotify. If you search it, it's public. And I share it with you. All the songs I talk about. It's a good mix. It's a really fun mix. Like you get that. Elton John and then Michael Franti. Carrie says, my word is once again alive. I love it. That's that I'm going with live al alive, live alive. You know, let's live alive. There's so much stuff to be <laughs> the other day, a, f a dear friend of mine, like we can almost never collide, collide schedules and all that. We have an hour to talk. 
I'm just going to go like this. Let's be alive. Let's be here. Let's be celebratory. Let's be in union with our love and our hearts. And if we're not there, you know, what's going on? Love yourself. Kindness. You don't have to shame yourself out of feeling otherwise. But uh, are we willing? I say, heck yeah, I'm willing. <laughs> I am willing. Caitlin, exactly. Try again. Beautiful. Try again. Try again. Gorgeous. It's the phrase of a willing heart right there. No tea for me. Hello. Good morning. Miss Carol, praise. Praise. Praise, because my ego did a great job calling me a cheater all week. So some praise for me and all I know I can do. Amen. Yeah. And it can call you a cheater all it wants. I know your integrity. I know your heart. And ha-ha. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. Ha-ha, ego. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure. Mm -hmm. Right. You're amazing. Pew. Shelby. Hi, Shelby. Word of the day, present. I am present. That's so beautiful. I'm here, right here. Wonder for Stuart. That's good. I love the word wonder. That's so beautiful. Melanie, still free. <laughs> Melanie is still free. Melanie is still free. I love that. You're still free. Good morning, Mickey. <laughs> Melanie, that sounds just like me. Yeah. Thank you, Carrie. I like it. I like it too. Lexi says, you make self-love sound like so much fun. You know, it is fun. I feel a little frisky sometimes. And other times I'm under the wave, all the way under. Like last weekend. And I was crying, you know, and this and that. And a friend of mine texted and was like, come on answered the phone. I was like, I will not answer the phone. Texting. I will not answer the phone. How upset. Ah, but you know, as dramatic as I can be, I start making myself laugh again. It's hard to stay there because I am not you, me. I am so ridiculous when I get to that place. So I do like feeling good. I do like taking care of myself. And <clears throat> Lexi, you know what's funny? The other day, what did we do? Like, how did we meet on an interview or something, Soul to Soul? Remember that series you wrote, 20 Questions? That's how, kind of how we met, right? Um, that popped up in my feed the other day. And I was thinking about you, and I was appreciating you. I was, just so you know, and um, I was feeling this thing about somehow you reminded me when I'm little, when I was little, I knew how to practice self-care. I was very good about self-care. There was something about it, and it wasn't like I painted my fingernails or braided my hair. There was something I knew. It was I was just remembering this somehow connected to you, that I knew how to rest I knew how to be in the sunshine. I knew how to drink lots of water um, and, and lots of stuff like that. And I had this really clear memory of that. Like self-care is one of the things I'm here to practice and help my friends learn. And I thought of you. It's just interesting, FYI. <laughs> I don't know if this is interesting, but I'm just telling you what's coming through. <laughs> so... Good morning, Allie. Allie, my pool is arriving right now, my little trough pool. I don't have the metal one. I have the blue one. Can you guys tell I'm excited? Yes. Don't look for any pictures of me in it anytime soon, but you know. <laughs> Hi, Paula. Mickey, thank you, Mickey. Your word is egoless. That's beautiful. Allie's word is celebrate. Celebrate. Woo, celebrate. Woo. Dance to the music. Woo! <laughs> Celebrate. Woo! Allie, that's good. Thank you, Shell. <clears throat> I could do it again. Yeah. Thank you, Shelly. I do. I want to be real. That's all I can be. That's all I can be. And I get really wrapped up in stuff myself. And 
that gives you good material that's all I know <laughs> gives you good material and you find friends who are in the same place who also don't want to be there that's the key because you know the other friends that like just want to complain and tell you how the world is forked forever I'm not into that and that's my biggest dilemma it's not really a dilemma right now is I can love you as the light you truly are but I am not listening to your bullshit how do I do that though you know what I mean without like taking off my shoe and throwing it because if you stay there long enough that's what you, I end up wanting to do clobber people and the other question I ask myself is how do I say no with grace ahead of time because like um, Lizzie I don't have your new beautiful napkin our daughter bought, bought me some she said I don't want to give you a donation for morning magic but I wanted to buy you a present to say thank you and she gave me some really cute you know to wipe the sweat so sorry you guys I have to go like this this is what happens when you have a dance party before you go on anyway hopefully I just look dewy and youthful but um <laughs> yeah I tell you I forgot what I was saying that's my realness for you right there. Oh, yes. Thank you. <laughs> my um, practice is, like, I know this ahead of time, and you're inviting me for whatever social distancing gathering or another one-hour complainathon on the phone. Okay. I have it in my memory bank. The last 800 times, we're the same way. Somehow I have this hopefulness in my heart that it's going to be different. But you know what? Acceptance is what's needed. Love and acceptance. I don't need to judge you because we're all sparks of the divine. This is truly our work. This is forgiveness. Shelly's word is forgiveness. Shelly, this is the truest forgiveness work there is, is to see the light in one another, but also to know our humanness and to say, it's all right. I don't particularly love how you're saying that or what you're doing. But I don't need to shame you or say, you know, talk you out of it or cheerlead you. I also don't have to go to your party, you know. This is where I'm at these days. How does one do that? And even as a healer, whatever that means, when I see people in sessions where it's just that same cycle, I want to love you where you're at, but I also want to say it's not the time for healing. It's the time to go play. Go ride your bicycle. Go ride your bicycle. Uh, uh. Pop some popcorn. Uh, uh. Watch a movie. Mm, mm. Don't call your healer. No, no. You know? I can't help it. This is kind of what happens when you get in, back into a good space so beloveds what can I say soul style that's what it was called Lexi okay <laughs> yeah I'm so excited about the tub Amanda Beck says totally relate when I resist answering the phone when my friends call is probably when I need to most yeah and you know this is what I love about your truest friends not true like like the, the friends who are risking their journey and their hearts and they're stepping in and they're willing, I know they're a little bit scared to do that, to call and say, come on, talk to me. But that's what they'll do. They'll risk it because it, it is scary, but they'll risk it, you know. I'm like that too. I've always been, I mean, how do you develop your high sense perception or your psychic ability or your intuition, however you want to call it? When you get the hit, follow it. Don't talk yourself out of it. So if your vibes say, send this song to your friend right now, you do it. Or call your friend right now, you do it. That's me, that's me though. <laughs> Pool party at Rob's house, yeah, <laughs> for sure. I think two of us can fit in at a time, but we'll take turns. <laughs> True story, when Elizabeth, Elizabeth, are you listening? When Elizabeth was, uh, that's Lizzie, when she was about five, she told her friends at summer camp, we have a pool at our house, we have a pool, we have a pool. And then she invited all of her friends over 
to play in the pool. And it was literally the little Walmart $30 pool that holds like, you know, 10 gallons of water. It was adorable because, you know what? Not one kid was disappointed. Everybody was excited and delighted. And I have never forgotten that day. I need to get the photo albums out. We had little um, watering cans. I still remember Kendra going around with her watering can and Liz was very like, we have to have snacks. So cute. Ah. Yeah. Hi, Mary. Good morning. Hello. Hello. <clears throat> That's right, Shelly. Spiritual and human. I love that, Carrie. We are always dewy and youthful. Amen. Stu, feeling down this morning? Really needed the reset of positivity. You love it. Hey, I love you, my friend, exactly as you are. And I'm so glad if you're feeling down, thank you for being here. So how many of us were feeling down today? Robin included. Uh, I know a few of you were too, because we've already talked this morning. Yeah. So it's making that choice to be together. And I love you in your downness. You know what I mean? It's like, thank you for showing up anyway. Because we need our, all of our sparkle family. We need our sparkly family. <laughs> Lizzie says, yes, listening. That's because you and Dad made it so fun. We, that was one of the best days of my life. And I have so many with you, honey so many and that's the that's the thing about me i'm gonna start telling you more because i can stay like on a high about us together and laughing for days and i don't think i always tell you so i'm telling you right now girl we're going to the beach later bring your mask i have the hawaiian one we're gonna have fun hi amy yay hi are the kids here Jeffrey, hello. Thank you for getting the pool. Carrie, yeah. Look at all the hands. Stuart, are you seeing that? All the hands in the air right now? Yeah. So, friends, you know what? <clears throat> There's nothing wrong with you. There's nothing wrong with me. And um, I put on a little Rick Astley, too, this morning. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna turn around and desert you. Never gonna hmm, make you cry. Never gonna say goodbye. Never gonna tell a lie and hurt you. Ooh, <laughs> give you up. Ooh, never gonna give, never gonna give, give you up. Are we gonna sing it? Yes. We're going to stay together today. We're going to ride together today. You're going to go into your day or for Carol and Josie and the rest of you overseas. You're going to ride into the rest of your afternoon and evening in your heart space. You're going to stay there. You're going to remember this heart and you're going to stay there. And if it feels intense, put on a song. Get out our playlist. I just added the Rick Astley song to our list. Get out our playlist and We'll be there with you. Call to our family. That's us. Call to your family. Love Posse. Oh, I feel it right now. I even get a smell. We have a smell. <laughs> and it might not just be all the patchouli I'm wearing. You know, I keep forgetting to tell you when the pandemic started, the humor -y side of me said, good, now I can wear all the patchouli I want. <laughs> I don't have to worry about it, you know? I would always be that one. I just put a little on, but I've worn it for decades. Just a touch. But then I'd be in the store, you know, like Whole Foods down some aisle, and somebody two aisles over, who has the patchouli on? And I'd be like... I'm not going to say it's me, but I love it. So, <laughs> yeah, Rick Rolling, that's right. I didn't know if anyone would know the Rick Rolling thing. <laughs> yeah, it's so, I don't know why I love that song so much. 
Amy says, recovering from a five day swirl of exhaustion. Happy to be here with the posse. And you know, thank you for presencing that because all the mamas in the house, all the papas in the house, all the dog mamas and papas in the house, all the, you know, swirling and exhaustion is real. And how do we ease it? I'm gonna start a healing. If you don't want healing, I still love you. You're still part of this. Just do this in front of your face. Friends on YouTube, that still counts. Just do it like that. So, um, <laughs> how many of us have been in a five day cycle of exhaustion? We get scared. We hear the news. We want, I, I mean, I, I love to get the paper. It started out as a way to put it in the garden over the weeds, but I read and read and read. And it's, it's become a very fascinating practice to work with the world of illusion, like the Course in Miracles talks about, the news, and then like, where am I really in all of this? And learning about my stories. So it's funny, but you know, like yesterday I read the paper and I laughed through the whole thing, but it's not funny, you know what I mean? It's not funny. Like sending troops to Chicago, not funny except it's so ridiculous that, um, you know? So we gotta stay in this place. Stay in this place. Beck said she loves the patchouli and she doesn't have to shave anymore. Yeah, <laughs> the other night, the kids came over the other night and I had a little evening bag, <laughs> sparkling evening bag in my hand. Liz was laughing so hard. I thought, I carry my phone and my glasses in my little evening bag, seriously. And then I just had on like, you know, some kind of a moo moo. But I realized sitting there, my legs look like the Berenstein Bears, because me too. Like I just maybe shaved my legs this morning because we're going to the beach and I don't want to be a spectacle. I want to be a different kind of spectacle if I am one. So, but <laughs> I have my little purse and my hairy legs and we had a really good laugh about it though. It was very funny. Yeah. Mary says, I love the patchouli. I diffused it at work and my supervisor came in and told me he was receiving complaints. Would I please stop? <laughs> yeah, I know. But, you know, I get it. I understand. <laughs> that is a very funny thing, though, at work. Yeah, to be told, please stop. Here comes this healing. Bex is acknowledging the five-day cycle. I was once on an airplane and I had some uh, peppermint. I just put a little dab on my nostril and the guy a couple seats away was really pissed off about it. I actually felt really bad because I hadn't thought that, I didn't realize, you know, I just, it was innocent. I had a stuffy nose and a, and a bit of a migraine, but he was so pissed off. Like for eight, it was a European flight. And I finally like turned to him and I said, I am so sorry. I don't know what to do at this point. I'm so sorry. But I actually kind of thought stuff like that diffuses. Like if you just put a dab on, you're not in a diffuser. That's different. But also, you know, you know what I want to say? Yeah. Anyway, I'm not going to say it. No. Mm -mm. So friends, this healing, you know, it's for that cycle. The crazy, the down, the sad, it's too long, it's too much. Where am I going? Where are we headed? You know what I mean? It's for that. It's for your immune system and it's for your little baby self. I was telling you the other day when I do healing, I actually hold you this way in my, you know, like hold your energy as a baby. Right back here, this place. There's a spot here that's really important. So how can you give yourself some love today? And also know, like if you put your hands here, you can say, I welcome the healing. I receive it now. 
you know it's really not robin's healing it's coming through me but you know you can receive it that way and i'm always here sessions i even offer a covid you know whatever look at on my website you'll see the link there and next week we're doing a healing circle there's a couple seats left um it's really just for morning magic fam so if you're here and you want to join just message me i'll send you a link that's the way we're doing it i want to keep it small and intimate so i'm really sending this to you even though it looks like i'm yeah so you know be fabulous today practice your self care good that's good mary and that's we will we do that in the healing circles too big sweeps yeah like a sun breath that's good so you can pull this energy up and where are you pulling it up from the air to the earth think about what's inside the earth how are our feet on the ground right now how are birds navigating their way how in the hell does that happen yeah let yourself ponder that and do your sweeps pull 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 and then swoop it down if you got anything that needs to come out shake it out shake it off shake it off shake it off if you want to pull down from from celestial energies you know really it's like 360 all the dimensions i know but we like our little figurative ways of seeing things do we not so you can pull down from the heavens you're a healer you can do this so i wish you the most blessed beautiful wonderful day i'm going to bring this to a close now and I'll say I posted this in the um, Instagram page today. Oh, it's a picture of my coffee cup with the frog, if you see it there. I posted a little prayer there. And um, let's do it now. You ready? I release now. I release now any intention I hold any intention I hold to keep my life waiting to keep my life waiting to postpone my joy to postpone my joy To hold back my good. To hold back my good. I release it now. <laughs> Yell it out. I release this now. I release this now. And in its stead, filtered through the light and the love of God, I recall. I recall. I reclaim. I reclaim. And I reintegrate now my light, my joy, my love, my light, my joy, my love, my peace, my ease, my wellness, my healing, my, my love. And so it is. Amen. A whole and ahoy. Ahoy, my spirit pirate friends. So let us ring the bell. And I send you off into the most glorious rest of your day. You are welcome, my friends. You are welcome. You are welcome. Yes, much love and sweetness for, for all of us here, says Amanda, and for this weekend. You are so welcome. Though I will be here this weekend. I will see you here in the morning. Let's ring the bell. And friends, I always welcome your support. You can make a donation or purchase a coffee mug or a course. All the links are in profile. You can even buy me a cup of coffee if you like. I appreciate it. So I'll see you here in the morning. Friends on the replay, there'll be another one tomorrow. And uh, let me know. 
yeah, peace and patchouli vibes to you. Thanks, friends. Satnam. call the old poop caboose to you again. New moment. We're fresh page. Fresh page. Somebody type now. Anna, you're welcome. Love you. <laughs> Amy says, Lexi. Some of you are just seeing each other. <laughs> I love that. Love you peeps too. Let's be strong today, okay? And remember your posse. Call on us. Just like Wakanda. Call on your posse. Love Posse, activate. Remember Wonder Twins, activate. Pew. Love Posse, activate. Now, now, now. Okay. That's pretty fast today. You are welcome, my friends. Fresh page now, my girl. Let's go. Guinevere. I'm going to give Melanie a new name today. Guinevere, you are welcome. Stuart. Hope the weather in your heart is a little smidgy better. I love you, Stuart. Love you, Posse, Jeff says. Aww. I love you all. I'll say the prayer out loud today and then I'm hanging up, okay? I know who you are in truth. I know what you are in truth. And I know how you serve in truth. You are free. You are free. You are free. You are free. 